In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the error code drown in Minecraft Nintendo Switch. Now, there's multiple reasons why this could be happening, and in this video, we're going to be going over the most common causes and how to fix it. So one method that I recommend that you guys try out is to sign out and then sign back in. And this will refresh your account's connection to Minecraft servers, resolving authentication glitches. Because even though Minecraft is the biggest game out there, especially on the Nintendo Switch, there are just so many absurd glitches and stuff like that. So you would go ahead and select on profile, then you would select on these three dots and then click sign out. And then you need to go ahead and sign back into your Microsoft account on the Nintendo Switch. And also don't forget to restart your game over here. And then from there, go ahead and see if that does actually work. The next thing you want to try out is your internet connection. So a weak or unstable internet connection can cause the error. So make sure that your Nintendo Switch is connected to a stable Wi-Fi network. That is really important. If you need to, go ahead and turn off your router for around a couple minutes and then turn it back on again and then see if that does fix the issue. Because sometimes the Wi-Fi could just be a little bit funky and if you just restart your router or maybe you try using mobile data or something like that, that is going to resolve the issue. The next thing you want to do is you want to make sure you have the most recent and up-to-date version of Minecraft. Having an outdated game version can cause compatibility issues with Minecraft servers. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go to the home screen. Then you want to press on the plus button, select on software update. Then go ahead and select on via the internet. And over here, it is going to scan for updates and stuff like that. And you just want to make sure you are using the most recent version of Minecraft because that is really important. Another thing that you guys should try doing is changing your Nintendo account. So you'll notice that at the moment, we actually do have two Nintendo profiles. So what could be happening is that you're using the wrong profile. So as you have to tell, I have two profiles right over here. And whenever I use this Frybright profile, it actually gives me the error. But whenever I use this profile, it actually does work. So if you have multiple different profiles, go ahead and try each and every single one of them until you find one that does work. Because sometimes certain profiles can be glitched out or they might have certain restrictions. So you want to go ahead and try out all the different profiles and see if those actually fix the issue but if none of these things work then what i recommend that you guys do as sort of a last resort is to reinstall minecraft so basically you will need to back up your worlds or rounds and stuff like that and basically what you need to do is you need to go ahead and go to system settings you need to go to system settings then you need to scroll down until you see data management then you want to go ahead and select on software manage software right over here then from here you can go ahead and find minecraft and basically you want to delete it and then reinstall it again and see if that works again that should only be as a last resort and guys please be very careful because you don't accidentally want to delete any of your minecraft world and stuff like that so if you don't even want to risk it at all then i actually don't even recommend doing this but if you don't really have any minecraft worlds that are important to you then go ahead and try doing that and honestly, the worst part about this issue is that there's no single cookie cutter solution that will work for everybody. So guys, if you have any other suggestions or you have any other ideas to fix this issue, let me know in the comment section down below so that you're able to help other people. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.